Al Rolls is the reporter thrown into the secretive world of the 4X supermodel where nothing is as it seems. Beware the techno monk and steer clear of Professor Coe and his two assistants. Give the senior trader a wide berth and don't expect any sense from the risk manager. Good morning, I'm Professor Code, and this is the Forex Supermodel Daily Briefing for Thursday the 1st of the 4th, 2021. The time is 0455 GMT, Asian session coming to a close, US, uh, European session firing up, uh, our lunchtime US session. Right, I've written this up, so uh, yesterday uh, we had a negative opposed uh, driver in the yen at minus 188, front and back door flows. Uh, going mainly into the pound at plus 153, next into the euro at plus 53, and the dollar was the negative rock at minus 20. Activity plus or minus 208. Intra week then becoming more relevant. This is from Monday the 29th, open to about 15 minutes ago. We've got it again. We've got a negative opposed driver in the yen uh, at minus 240. Front and back door flows mainly going into the pound at plus 165. The dollar at plus 154 and the euro was the negative rock at minus 79. Activity plus or minus 319. Intra week then, uh, this is what's happening in the Asian session to about 15 minutes ago. We've got a, a positive uh, opposed driver in the yen this time, plus 29, front and back door flows, mainly coming out of the euro at minus 25, out of the dollar at minus 10, and the pound is the positive rock at plus 6. Activity plus or minus 35. Right, we're going to stop it there because I have to go out. Uh, today early uh, so I'm going to write it up just to save time don't go away right welcome back what's going to knock those flows about today well um, Thursday early we've had uh, the first we've had trade balance which has been slightly negative for the AUD uh, imports up exports down China PMI soft but above 50 um, and later today we've got German uh, retail sales US PMIs and Friday we've got an FP the OPEC decision to, is later on today for their meetings. Biden's uh, 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 um, uh, was an infrastructure plan that was uh, was out yesterday. Uh, market holidays in Asia, uh, Singapore, Hong Kong, New Zealand, and AUD. So bear that in mind. Right. Okay. These are the flows then. So we're in the full complexes. Euro is strong except against the dollar, yen, and the pound. The yen is strong overall. Uh, the pound is strong except against the yen. The Swiss franc is uh, is weak except against the CAD, the AUD and the NZD. Notice these are the commodity currencies. The CAD is weak except against the AUD. The AUD is strong across the board, uh, weak across the board, sorry. New Zealand, New Zealand dollar is weak except against the AUD and the CAD. And the dollar is strong except against the yen and the, the pound. So, so we've got yen strength, um, AUD weakness, uh, We've got um, commodity currencies come off uh, basically um, at the moment. So stop it there, write up the next thing. Right, we're back again then. So uh, US dollar index uh, broke the highs. Uh, it's it's, it's uh, broke the next high and it's come back a little bit. Gold, uh, double bottom, slightly bounce, 0.1 from the floor. Oil, bear in mind the OPEC meeting, is uh, about 0.4 from our modelled high. Wall Street then uh, uh, broke the resistance uh, came back to uh, the previous resistance and it's now just just subbed the, the second high. Likewise with the S&P. Tech never really uh, tech never really made it and it's operating about 0.6 from our modelled floor. Um, uh, US 10 years, uh, this is the price, so uh, basically we've got strong yields. Uh, the yields went even lower yesterday and then they bounced to about the uh, Double, double bottom and the bund is uh, it, this is price so the bund uh, yields are a little bit lower so there's a, the discrepancy between the US and the European yields continues US steel broke the resistance the double the, the double the top um, and is now operating a little bit higher right so uh, let's just finish off then um, our trades have improved we were about 2500 points uh, up now Again, we've added uh, a couple of positions. Um, the the only different one we've added is we've got one one times long uh, pound 
pound dollar. So we were long pound dollar, we're long AUD uh, dollar, and we're short NZD against the euro, the pound, the CAD, and the AUD. Right, so there are trades. We, uh, it's been pretty gutty trading those, pretty, pretty wild, but we've been in profit generally. Um, we're, these are medium, medium term trades. We're expecting them to, to improve. So I uh, hope that was useful. Sorry it was uh, stop started, but I do need to go out. So see you tomorrow for the daily briefing, which hopefully will be as per normal. Thank you very much.